at a poplar tree in a client's yard about three years ago, and we just went and picked up the slabs, got them surfaced, and then we're starting our book match table and matching benches. Welcome back to another episode of Arbor Upcycle TV. Today we are here at my good friend Josh's shop where we just took that poplar book match and the two benches and we had it lacquered. And it's looking amazing, so we're packing this thing up to delivery and gonna put it over in the client's home today. Uh, but before we do that, this is Remy and he's the master arborist and this is where all of our wood comes from, so. Yeah, I'm the arborist side of Arbor Upcycle and uh, we had a client approach us in 2017 with a, uh, what Clint mentioned, a, poppy, a poplar in their backyard in San Bruno uh, under PG&E lines that had, in the poplar, had been repeatedly topped over time and uh, there was failures start to happen, decay that was prevalent, but still a very sizable trunk, about 15 feet tall. Um, so in removing the tree, we offered some consultation into the fact that there was it was a great hardwood and could be repurposed and upcycled into uh, projects uh, into their new home. So uh, here we are, full cir uh, circle. And to go into a little bit of, uh, about the tree, it is uh, uh, scientifically uh, known as the Populus nigra italica, popularly known as the Lombardi poplar, and uh, it's a great hardwood. This is not, as Clint might have mentioned in the past, this is not its natural color. Um, it was stained and then lacquer uh, to fit the client's request to match the uh, overall uh, aesthetic, uh, of, the aesthetic of the home. So, um, but yeah, after we slabbed, uh, after we felled the last portion of the trunk in the backyard in 2017, we slabbed everything with an Alaskan mill on site and per request by the client, stacked everything in their backyard and they air dried it for about two and a half years till they reapproached us um, to take a look at the wood. Uh, we, we, we did some moisture tests and uh, confirmed that the wood was stable and dry enough to enter its second stage of, um, of life, so to speak. And that's when it came back to our wood shop and Clint took it from there and did this beautiful book match seamlessly put these, these two sister slabs together of, of the mill, boom, uh, book matched it together and, and uh, here's the finished product and it's ready for delivery. All right, so that kind of wraps up this project with the poplar book match and benches. And um, client's really happy, looks beautiful in the home. And uh, we're just really glad to do a project like this. Uh, this is really the ethos of what we want to do is uh, letting these oldest residents of San Francisco live on um, long past their years of being in the ground. And um, this one came out really good, we're really happy. So if you, are interested in having a little piece of San Francisco or just in salvaging something beautiful, feel free to hit us up anytime. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. See you next time.